Hi, I'm Geraldine and I work at Youth Connect. I run a business called My Other Kitchen. Oh, my name is Timothy Lynch, I'm a director of Ray White Real Estate. I'm with Woolworths and uh, I think most people would know Woolworths, we're a, we're a national company. If I wanted to change one thing about Moorabbin, what would I change? I'd probably change a number of things, but um, I'd like to see better lighting in the streets. I'd like to see a better mix of, uh, of offices. Uh, we're actually looking at expanding our business. So for us, it's more about um, moving into a space that's new and fresh and where people are comfortable coming. All of a sudden, local business like that just died out. So it'd be good to see some shops coming back. There's some of the challenges, as we said, um, if you look at Moorabbin Junction in particular, it's around, look, there's a lot of, um, it's, it's economics, competing interests that are drawing, you know, making life a little bit hard for small businesses. And I think ultimately, really, it is small businesses and local communities that make these sort of precincts come alive. The thing that attracts me to Moorabbin Junction is the fact that it's going to be new and fresh and we'd like to get in on the ground floor. I, I think Moorabbin's, um, it's, it's got quite a, a strategic location. Um, it's uh, in the middle of a, a, a residential, two residential areas. I think there's plenty good about Moorabbin. Um, you know, it's a, it's a good centre. Um, it needs a bit of work and, and I think that's the purpose of why we're all here. It's generally a very safe area to live in um, and it's got very, very well uh, benefited by the services around it. I, th I think we've just grown up here grown up knowing the football ground at the end of the road and uh, the little playground, um, the shops. Uh, we own our building because we wanted to be part of the movement in Moorabbin to be a stable structure in Moorabbin because we could see the future that was there. It's got fantastic, um, if you like, amenity. There's trains, there's buses, there's schools, it's proximate to the beach. So there's a lot of things going for it, but it's just at a point in time where you know, it's in a transition. So it's patience uh, and a lot of careful nurturing that'll see it have a bright future.